What's up guys? Leg day. What's today's date? The 17th. She's mad. She's mad at me because I'm being cranky towards her. Ain't just scary. It's about to be legendary. Just got home. Walked in to let the puppies out. Puppies, man. And you're like, oh, they're so sweet. I want a million of them. And then you're like peeing everywhere. They're destroying your house. They smell. They're rolling in poo. They're eating poo. You have to bathe them every freaking five seconds. They wouldn't be able to come in your house. Junk all over them. But man, still love them. I'm going to get a haircut right now. This is what it looks like now. A little long on top still. But it's the sides that I get really mad about. I'm starting to see all the gray coming in. So instead of looking 28, I start looking 42. I don't know. It's weird. Everyone thinks I'm way older. It's probably the bags under the eyes or wrinkly forehead or bald patches or excessive amounts of gray hair. It's a lot of things. Okay. But, uh, yeah. Blam! I'm sexy! No, I'm not sexy. I'm just... I look slightly younger. Chin the beard up a little. Get ready for my date tonight, the lady. We don't go on dates often, so it's like a big deal. This is our Valentine's Day date. We're not gonna do Valentine's Day stuff. She wants to see Fifty Shades Freed. I wanna see Black Panther but we're going to dinner, some nice steakhouse. It is a refeed day, so I'll have to still be conservative by the time we get to dinner, and I can't have snacks at the movies. But it's gonna be fun, I think. She's gonna just be going to town on all this delicious food, delicious alcohol, delicious dessert, delicious Sour Patch Kids, delicious movie theater popcorn with extra butter and extra salt. She can do those things and still look that good, and I can't. <sighs> Sorry. Ugh. All right, we're getting ready to go out. Miss Cherish doing her hair. This is the outfit of the day. Extra large sweater, extra long sweater, not extra large. <laughs> and extra large boots. And I am wearing all black, black vest, black shirt, black jeans. Go to the messy closet. Black shoes. Actually, everything I'm wearing right now is from Express. Even my belt. <laughs> everything on my body. And I don't I don't have underpants on. Is that an overshare? Never mind. Babysitter will be here at 5.45 to meet the kids. Damn dogs. Look at this. This is what they did earlier. Freaking dogs. Look at they broke into they broke that panel right there. That was completely that little tree they wrecked. Used to be nice like that one. That tree completely knocked over, and I tried to put this like makeshift thing up until the screen person can come. He's not got back to me yet. This like, cause this all just happened this morning. The tree fell, buddy, but I fixed it. I'm gonna go clean this up real quick. Honey, how many dates do you think we've been on in like the last year? Um, I'd say probably like five. But we don't go out much. Food just came. She's so happy. She got a blueberry mojito. I ended up getting a glass of wine, which is so good. She got something chicken stuff. We're gonna share this some mac and cheese. And then I got a eight ounce filet with blue key, blue cheese crust, two lobster tails with some butter. We are done with dinner. I am stuffed, feel real bad about myself. We're going to see, is it called Fifty Shades Free? Freed? Freed, Freed yeah. with the D? Yeah, with uh, the, give it the D. Give it the, oh Jesus. Uh, Cherish had a drink. Um, <laughs> <laughs> she had one. <laughs> one drink and I turn into a Christ person. We will give you this our honest review of this movie. You there. We need directions to the AMC. Yeah. Magiano. We have arrived. She's like, oh my God. There's gonna be so much sex in the opening scene. It's gonna be awesome. Which is weird. Because there's all these weird like other people around too. So it doesn't make any sense. Anyway, we're here. Shut up. <laughs> we'll give you guys our review after, after this. What do you, let's, let's do a prediction. What do you predict it's gonna be? Good. On a scale of one to ten. Seven or eight. Predicting a four. Does everyone know that this is Twilight just without vampires and, and wolves? It's Twilight. We're, you're watching Twilight. Yeah, they. Oh, pretty much that's. It was in Twilight though. Like they broke in the bed and like it got crazy. So they were like, let's take that part and then like put it in just regular people's lives and we'll just basically change the name of the characters, but they're not vampires and wolves now. It's Twilight. <laughs> Watch everything that he says. Watch Twilight. Watch Fifty Shades. It's the same shit. Goodbye. All right, you just got home. Babysitter just left. Plex is doing that. Hey, inappropriate. A little puggle. Hi, puggle, 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 puggle. Movie review. Out of all three, it was the best one for sure. Out of that genre of movie, which is what? Romantic thriller? Four. Romantic Four. thriller, softcore thriller. I'll give it an eight. 8.6571. It was good. It was the best out of all three. Plex, get out of the shower. 
I'm going to bed now. It's late. I'm not wearing a watch. What time is it? It's almost 12. Way past my bedtime. I need to get some sleep. I'll see you guys later. Please hit thumbs up if you guys like this video. Please, 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 please. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. You guys will never see more Cherish. And um, that's all I got. Shut up. Hit your macros. More flex. More flex. <laughs> Hit your macros. More Don't forget. Bye.